for uploading the iOS app to the guest flight, you must have to open first the Xcode. Xcode and so uh, after this, uh, you have to open your Xcode project. So I already have one Xcode project available inside this Mac. So I will choose open existing project so after this uh, we have to open that xcode project and it is inside documents ionic plugins ios folder app and we have to open app.exe workspace file so this is the uh, ios uh, project file so this is the ios app project file so we have to open exe workspace file so after let's click open So it's uh, loading, it's uh, opening inside the project is opening inside uh, the Xcode. So uh, after opening, we have to take care of few things. So in general, we must have to put the build and version name, version number. So it is already available here. Build is one, version is 1.0. And this is the iOS uh, version. You can take care. Uh, so in my case it's 13.0 the minimum ios uh, version is 13.0 okay so after this uh, you have to go to signing and, and capabilities so you have to choose automatically manage signing so it will it will xcode will create and update profile app id and certificate everything okay so you must you can choose automatically manage signing you can do manually but in my case i choose the automatically manage signing you have to select the teams okay uh, the, in my case this is my team and you have to uh, mention your bundle identifier basically this is the package name uh, which is available inside your uh, project so this few things you have to must take care uh, inside signing and capabilities after this uh, there are a few things which must you, you have to take care um, okay so in build setting uh, you can uh, choose target device family like in my case the app is for only iPhone but if your app uh, will available for iPhone and iPad you, you can select this but in my case this is only for iPhone okay so now after this after doing this change edge and uh, you can simply go to product and click archive so it is building and let's check what will happen okay build is success now uh, we have to click uh, this is the build basically now we have to simply click our uh, distribute app to upload on the test flight and now we have to check uh, put the first option we have to select the first option test flight and test app store the app will be uh, upload first on test flight after testing this you can move this uh, to the app store so first will app will go to the test flight first so now after selecting this we can click distribute so it will do a lot of things like preparing signing everything okay so we have to english united states it will be good now we have to click next upload for app store okay okay so we have to this is the error the app name you entered is already being used so we have to change the app name basically so let's copy from this here so this is our project basically this is ionic project from where we build the uh, ios uh, app so this is the app id this is the app name so let's copy this ionic framework search so we have to put inside this the name sq will be okay so now let's try again
so it is doing uh, multiple things in background uh, like verification signing uploading so so it is done so after uh, some time it will available on test flight